Hello everyone and welcome to a brand new series. This series is going to be a full game walkthrough on Pirate 101. So let's just skip all the pre-talk and let's get into the new character. We're looking for hard to say you there you're standing on me blindside are you a boy or a girl what's your name pirate actually not too sure what we're gonna go with i know the first name we're gonna leave blank wherever it is there and then we're gonna go with let's go with matthew or you know what? Let's let's leave the the last name empty and then we'll do a first one. We'll do like spooky or something. Is there a spooky? There's spiffy. Um We'll go. Two faced. Not actually sure here. Um, let's just go with. Wicked. We'll go with wicked. I told you. There it is. The one. Maybe so. If you are who you say you are, prove it. We know you're an orphan. How'd you lose your parents? Okay, and this one, we're gonna go with Storm. Uh, I believe Armada is the little hamster guy. Um, Mutiny is the dead Mike. Squid Attack, I believe that's the little crab guy. Shipwrecked might be the dog, but we're gonna go Storm. That I believe that's the little rat. Your mom and pa were lost in a storm, you say? I have seen it before. It is not a good way to go. All right. So, who raised you then? Where We're going to be go? going with Crocotopia. You learned to fight in the arenas of Crocotopia under the blazing sun? You must be very good with a staff. Crocotopian pit fighting is deadly. So, how do you end up locked in this brig? What crime did the Armada arrest you for? And, of course, as voted by the community, we're going to be going with a witch doctor. Which means we were practicing some hoodoo. Practicing hoodoo? The Armada's outlawed all magic, don't you know? Oh, I did not realize you are a witch doctor. Can you hear curses and speak with spirits? It honestly would make more sense to go with Dead Mike in this scenario but you know, you know i think it'll be fine style, expression and whatnot. this is hair um let's just go there do i guess since we're a witch doctor we could go with white hair oh whoa what is that nope let's get rid of that um let's go there Is there anything that, whoa, excuse me. I guess that's fine. And if we can get something a little spooky, let's go white and white. Let's go there. A pirate must dress to impress. How do you present yourself? Got a little skull on there, we'll go with that. Actually kinda like that. We'll stick with there. And sure. And then I kinda want we'll go black. Whoa.
Actually, since we're doing that, maybe we need to do, get some kind of... Here, we'll go with that. We're going to look like a true pirate. Yeah. And then for the trim, let's actually go... Let's go just like that. Some, like, bland colors. I feel like that speaks witch doctor to me. I don't know. Probably going to get clowned. Actually, what? I guess let's go with this one then. Kind of matches a little bit better. And boom. We'll stick with that. You're gonna need a flag. Every self-respected pirate needs a flag. Select an icon for your flag. And then for the this one. To choose its base and trim colors. Wouldn't it be something if you pick squid attack and you go for that? Hmm. Could go for some kind of skull. This is a cool one, to be fair. That is pretty cool. We might go with that. Yeah, let's go with that. And we're gonna go black, and we're gonna go. Let's go black and white. That's yeah, fine. Now choose how the field behind the icon is arranged. Use the color buttons to choose the base and trim of your flag's field. And this, I believe this is the one that decides the companions. Let's go ahead and set this to black and then this one to white. Then we can find from there, I guess. We could just go with this. Nope, that's the one. That's it right there. I believe. Or we can go for something like England. No, we're going with this one. The colors you pick for your flag. Oh, that kind of looks bad. Hold up. Well, maybe it's just because Can Po is just like that. No, we're going to keep it that way. We're going to go with our gut. There's piratin to be done. Here we go. Yeah, we'll skip the tutorial. Um, it's kind of we can we can skip some time there. But anyways, we got Campo, level one goat, swashbuckler dude. Now, he's captain. Yeah, perfect. On the run from the Armada, are you? Well, I run a pirate haven here, not a charity. If you want me to hide you, you'll have to work for it. One of my more willful crewmen, a buccaneer named Finn, stole a jade amulet from me. I need it back. Finn fled to Skull Mountain and roused the Troggies. Now they're bombarding us. Get my amulet back. Report to Chief Rigby at the West Bastion. If you're to be a pirate, you'll need a ship. Do this right, and I'll give you one. You have my word of honor. Do Let's we change. have an Let's go to... Blockfather. And then, from here, I believe I actually have some things in my bank that I can actually equip already. So let's run down there real quick. As long as I can. I do have a pet in there. It's not the best pet. And, in fact, I have no idea what a good pet is for Pirate. Welcome home, Pirate. Okay. This house is your refuge so, from the crowded skies. Got this one. Yahoy, Pirate! There. Did you know oh. you can place your crew in your house? Nah, you found your bank, I see. Every Pirate needs a place to store their most precious loot for later. Yeah, we gotta... There's no reason for that one, but I just... I just like the aesthetic of it, so we're going with it. And then we even got a mount, and there he is. Alright, so let's equip all this stuff. I know we didn't really have this stuff on for long, but here we go. Hopefully we look a little bit better. 
just add that on for no reason. And then... There we go. And whenever our pet decides to actually join battle, it's going to be OP. So, at least for the first little bit of the game. <laughs> this is the only mount I have, and it's from Christmas. So, do not clown me for that. Ahoy there! Keep your head down, lest you're looking to be blown up. Blasted troggies. They've gone mad, they have. You want to help? We need to stop this bombardment. Go find Bonnie Ann. She went across the bridge to teach the Truggies a lesson. You'll do more good there. Imagine you actually have to walk all the way across that little rope bridge. All right, here she is. Actually, very, very soon you get Bonnie in. So who are you then? Avery sent you. Good. You've come just in time. That Finn, he's a wily one. He riled up the trogies till they're mad as badgers. The slimy devils raided us last night. Took half our powder stores. Now they're flinging it back at the town. We're trying to fight back, but there's too many of them. There she is. Soften them up a bit and I'll help you find Finn. Report to Lieutenant Smollett after. Look at the footprints. There is a safe path here. Let's get yeah, we have to fight them anyways. You don't so. need to tell your companions how to fight. They can do it on their own. That actually, I think, Select might be Select companions new. to give specific elders. If you don't hear in fine. combat, Ooh. later you can have up to four pirates in a fight. But we'll get to that. Okay, and I... Yeah, this has infinite range, too. Look at that. It might actually be a little OP. Tempo. Uh oh, never mind. Oh, he did. Yeah, our pet is definitely OP for this level. Don't worry, it is not a waste. A little mismatched here, but it's fine. That is open. Victory! After you win a fight, no enemies will attack you for a few seconds, so you can get smartly done, pirate. Now we'll show these croaking fiends the error of their ways. Well done indeed. You're good to have around in a fight. I said I'd help you find Finn, and I'm a girl on my word. You have room for another on your crew, Captain. Here it is. Very, very soon. Here she is. He already comes with double tap. Actually, I should probably see fit. what Campo comes with. Soon enough. Skull Island's threatened pirate, and it's up to us to save it. The Troggies are using three great slingshots to hurl firebombs at the West Bastion. The bombardment's wearing down the town's defenses. Our cannons could destroy them, but the farthest slingshot's out of range. Not only that, but the gunners can't see the other two through all this jungle. Go to the third slingshot and set off the powder kegs they're flinging to destroy it. Scout out the other two slingshots and mark them on this map. Why don't we just destroy them also? We'll have to get pretty close to mark them. That's Be fine. Careful. Report back when you're finished. Oh, she's Good level hunting. three also. Okay, yeah. So he comes with her post. That's actually really good. Uh, we're not going to level him up just yet. I feel like that's just a waste of training points. Uh, although I'm not the best Pirate 101 player, so... Excuse me. No! Oh, I should have walked on the path. I should have walked on the path. You know what? It's fine. Our pet's amazing. Actually, what we're going to do, we're going to attack this one. And then Campo is going to get a little thumb. And that'll be perfect. Now, does this one poison or does it give us health? Okay, it's poison. Ooh, Campo. The god. I swear. Yeah, I just... There's actually a really good charm about this game whenever it comes to the companions and leveling them, leveling them up and then whenever you level them up they actually uh, get promotions and stuff and they actually Our change their appearance. I really like that. Fly, but two more remain. Keep to the safe path or the troggies will surely attack us. Oh, like right here. I probably should get over. Here we go. 
Yeah, but that's definitely really fun. I can't wait to get our first promotion. Well, I'm not well. sure now we must report back when it is, but I feel like can pose somewhere up there. And I also can't wait to unlock even more. It's gonna be so so much fun. You did it, pirate! Now we'll answer their slingshots with cannons. Now that the Trogi artillery is out of action, we can look to getting Captain Avery his bauble back. Finn fled up the trail. I'd wager he's hiding in the Skull Cave. I sent two of my best scouts, Livesey and Shepard, up the trail to see. They've been gone for hours. Go see if the Troggies got them. If Livesey and Shepard are alive, they'll know where Finn is. Also, so much better I got a mount here. We're gonna be moving. Um, can we just cross through here? We can. Maybe we can't. There we go. But not sure exactly how to play Witch Doctor. My main you there. Help. is a swashbuckler, so very different. They came and you're here. You need to get me out of here and right quick before the Troggies come back. I can't get the lock open. We need the key. One of the Troggy shamans must have it. Bring me that key. They're Witch Doctor also. Man, look at our pet go. Wait, so we can only have one? We can't have Bonnie? Honestly, we might need to switch to Bonnie. Just because she has ranged attacks. Nothing against Campo, because he's amazing. I mean, just look at him. I guess we don't need it whenever our pet's a god. trail but he's not alone there's a whole gang of sharks up here cutthroats by the look of them they set up a camp across the bridge they're up to something Shepard and I found him but the sharks attacked and we got separated I didn't see Finn but he must be near you attack the cutthroats to draw him away I'll sneak into their camp and see what I can find out when I'm done I'll hide in the mouth of the skull cave we'll meet again there you're getting stronger Time for your companions to join in. Yeah, let's Kids, let's see if we can. Levels just like you. Spin Almost. Points to raise a we'll level. level up a little bit more. more I'm going. Oh, this is dangerous. Look under the companion display window to see how many training points way. you have. Now click your lowest level companion to select them. Click the train button. We have found this skull it cave. Way. It is well named. And there are the cutthroats. Let's go pick a fight. All right, let's go. You can actually have one of these as a companion from one of the bundles, and I'm not sure how worth it these bundles actually are. Yeah, that's a little unfortunate there. But wait, don't these also have a chance to fizz? Can we fizz just like in Wiz? Hold up, please tell me no. We even have this. Nice. Or is that. Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. The fizz is only. Hold up. No, no, no. Fizzing is only on. Like natural attacks, I think. Just sneaking in the bush. Well done, pirate. During your diversion, I found this note. Listen to this. Our buyer won't be here for a while. I'll be in the temple. When the buyer arrives, bring him to me. The temple entrance is in the skull cave. To know the light, pass through darkness. Into the skull cave, dragonfly. Yeah, I like Kempo. Kind of cool. I think all of the companions are from Mushu, weirdly enough. Look there, dragonfly. A chest. 
It might hold anything. I think so. Only There's one way to know. Action, Campo, Subadai. A little Kobe guy. Who am I missing? You've got a new bit of gear. To put it on, click the hook in the top menu. Not then even worth. Back. Behind the waterfall, we found it. Looks like we'll have to cut our way through. Who else is left? Hold up, how am I blanking? Oh, what is the the guy for? A short path back to the fort, Dragonfly. It will serve us well. Wait a second. What is the last one? Hold up. Talk with Mushi, right? Getting lost? Your quest arrow will point where you need to go. These tunnels are crawling with crocogators. But we can sneak past them if we keep to the walls. Really cool area though, to be fair. I just wish they actually updated the game and maybe now that it's on Steam, which is why they're running this promotion to have free memberships for about a week. Um, but I hope that means that they actually update the game and give a lot more content. But, I mean, at least add some new companions or something, or new new side quests, maybe. Oh. That water. The obstacle Oops. is. Th that water's too deep and too fast. We'll never make it. The obstacle is the path, Dragonfly. We must find another way. You there, come here, quick. Livesey sent you. Very good. When Livesey and I split up, I made me way in here. I've been trapped here for hours, watching and listening. Finn's across the way there in the throne room. The girl's right. The water's too rough to swim. You want to cross? There's a shrine at the other end of the tunnels. Press the keystones on the three statues there, and the water will drain. But look out. The Trogis are holed up in that shrine. They'll do everything they can to stop you. But you'll need to get into the shrine first. It's locked up tight. I overheard some of these sharks talking. Seems one of them found a key. Right, I believe that is actually the place we need to get to over there. Can Bonnie and Snape one of these guys? Just out of range? Come on, Bonnie. Okay. I guess it's whatever. They still do mass. Bo Bonnie, what are you doing? You're a musketeer. Why are you getting closer? Right, you know, at least... Wait, he's not even dead. Okay, Bonnie. All right. I take back what I said. We've got the key. Nope, never mind. Uh, so we'll just set a little mark right there. I remember whenever I started playing the game, there wasn't a mark. At least I don't think there was a mark feature. Uh, I started playing a while ago, and I actually just came back to the game. Throughout this promotion, honestly. So hopefully we can get a, a bit of the game done. And you know, if the support is actually uh, pretty strong, maybe I'll continue the series See after the promotion. The it's a sigil, and that means there's action on the other side of that door. What level are we? What up to a glowing sigil? We are still level whoa, still level In three. Second timer we begin. When the timer's done, every player on the sigil enters a room together. All right. Now, I know this one we do not have to actually fight. Is Campo here? Campo! Yay. Can I? Okay, I cannot use these. So what I'm going to do is Bonnie's going to go over here. Campo's going to go there. I'm going to go this way. And then we're going to try and all three hit them. I believe she can get that next turn. Me and Campo might take about two turns. And then, <laughs> perfect, our, our pet can just take care of that. The more of these we hit, though, um, the more spawn. So. 
At least we got one of them next turn. Ooh, resisted. Alright, so we got one next turn. I think Campo might actually take two turns to get there. Ooh, hit him with the block? Oh, and he's protecting Campo. Let's go. Yeah, I probably should rename him. But wait, can you even rename pets here? Okay, um. I guess we'll just burst that. Then yeah, next turn. Alright, Kempo, you're a swashbuckler. Why is it taking you so long to get there? If we would have blocked that too, that would have been mad. Alright, Campo, get over there. Gonna switch to Campo. Boom. Ooh, double tap? Go off? Alright, we won now. Look at that animation. Perfect. I think we're good. Yeah, so now we can actually teleport back. Okay. Perfect. Badges are special honors for a special accomplishment. I don't understand how, like, I don't think the physics work like that. I'm pretty sure this should still be filled with water, but you know, it's it's whatever. You did it. The water's passable now. I should report back, but if you're going after Finn, I'll help you first. Finn and I have a score to. Ye found an ally. Allies fight on your side for one battle, but not under your Let's direct control. Right here. Steady there. You're about to head into a nasty fight. Make sure your companions are to it. Press you to open companion management and train your crew to the highest I, level possible. I honestly don't think we need it. I think we're fine here. Unless, are we still level... I still level 3. We haven't been getting anything. What was this? That's a nice looking cane. Wonder what it's doing down here. Oh, aye. There are initials engraved here. We should take it back to him. Parker's no beggar. He'll make it worth our while. You can find him at the Gypsy right, Wagon you know, that's fine. Avery's mansion. It's free XP. I you think we made good. three mistakes, pirate. First, you took the job. Second, you didn't bring an army. Last, don't fight me in the dark. The dark is where I shine. Now, now we just have to kill Finn. That's the easiest part here. Hold your ground, friends. Cutthroats are bullies and cowards. Beat their leader and the rest will turn tail. So get Finn! Yeah. So realistically, I think he's dead. Like in a, in a few, we'll just, or we'll give Campo that little thing. Mega hit too. That's doing mass. Now yeah, if he gets anywhere near us, he's dead. Oh, c come on, Campo. Okay, so maybe it'll take three turns. Ooh, so Ruby? 20% chance. You'd think it'd be a little less than that. Let's go for it. Um, sure. And actually, how much does that do? Scene. We'll just sure, go for it. 
another mega hit. Yeah, that's OP, I feel. And Kenpo do some. It is it does look pretty cool though, to be fair. So whenever he gets buffed up, he'll be good. Now come on, finish him off. Okay. We got this. We didn't even take any damage from this. No targets in range? What? There we go. Alright, no way he survives this. Uh, well, now I'm kind of scared. Oh, no. Hold up. Oh, no. Campo! He turned into a god. Uh oh. Okay, I'm pretty sure this, this guarantee kills. You know what? Just in case... Yeah, this is the one that heals me, I think. Never mind. Which one am I thinking of then? Right, there we go. I want you Oh shit. I want you to remember this moment, pirate. This is the moment you won your first victory. And the moment you made your worst enemy. That you can buy in the crown shop. Shit, it's yours, you bully. I think. Well done, pirate. You're a good one to have handy in a fight. I'll report back to Lieutenant Smollett. You take the amulet to Avery. I hope we meet again. Bully, let me actually see. <laughs> it's probably in here somewhere. Okay, actually, right now, it's just these. Uh, th that's who it is. It's a little crane guy. Yeah, so I believe all of them are from Mushu. All right, and then we can just go right there. Easy. And real quick, where is he? There he is. What's up? Step up to my wagon yeah, just free, of wonder. Free XP, the so I'd recommend grabbing here. that. 400 XP. I believe that's enough. Isn't this where we also get our little raft? You've done it. The Troggy bombardment has stopped, you've recovered my amulet, and Finn is brought to justice. Well done. You didn't even try to swap my amulet for a fake. What are you, an honest pirate? <laughs> there we go. I could probably, um, uh, well, level up Campo a, a little bit. Deal and you've done your part sure as silver. A ship I promised, and a ship you'll have. You take this writ down to the docks and seek out Dock Master Dan. He'll see to it. Farewell to ye, Captain. There we go. You know, honestly, we'll just, we'll train him up to three also. That's fine. Where am I going? You know, just so he feels, feels a part of the crew. I don't know what he gives. We can also get our... Um, companion from the uh, school so we'll do that after when we, when we actually have to talk to them which should be in a little bit here's our fake ship which I actually think we do get that ship at some point oh, Avery sent you to claim a boat I see congratulations you're the proud owner of that mighty ship Oh, I'm sorry, my mistake. That's not your ship. That's the one. And what a ship she is. <laughs> You'll yeah, this be is the not that bad. Of the skyways in that beauty. <laughs> <clears throat> if I may be so bold, young pirate, that boat is indeed the saddest excuse for a ship that ever moored at this harbor. I cannot see. But even from here, I distinctly hear its worn planks creaking and groaning like a sick yak. 
Avery has not been honest with us. Go to him and demand what is yours. I believe after this is where we get to talk to our teacher. Level four. One more level and it's actually not that bad. It means we're actually only, what, 65 levels off from max? Pretty easy, right? What? You don't like your boat? I mean, your ship? Oh dear. But I'm afraid there's nothing to be done. I've honored the letter of our agreement. I'm afraid I can't give you a better ship, Captain, but I can point you toward that which every pirate loves even more Here than the ship. Treasure. Have you ever heard of Captain Gunn? Tis a fine tale, and like the best of tales, it ends in gold. Captain Gunn was a the legend cheese? of the Skyways. Feared by pirates and princes from Marleybone Your to Manchester, a finer smuggler never slipped past a blockade. Gun sailed to Mushu, mysterious realm of the samurai and the ninja pig. And there, he made a tremendous discovery. On the cliffs of Mushu, there grows a rare and tasty delicacy, yum yum fruit. The most precious commodity in the spiral. That's right, yum yum fruit. It can cure disease, grant strength, and even restore youth. And it makes your breath minty fresh, which is nice. Unfortunately, the Emperor of Mushu holds yum yum tree sacred. Stealing yum yum fruit is punishable by death. If you get caught, Gun smuggled back loads of the stuff, and he sold it by the ton. Yum bread, yum cake. Yum pudding, but his real stroke of genius was when he bottled it, and he called his creation Yum. Pirates went crazy for Yum, and everybody else did too. Gun was rich, he even trademarked the song. Whenever a pirate sings Yo Ho Ho in a bottle of Yum, crafty old Gun makes a penny. When he retired, Captain Gun was the richest pirate in history. And then he died. So, where's Gun's gold? knows his last will and testament is the key and it's been lost for years until now oh an associate of mine found the will and i can get you on his crew if you do me one favor Wait, so is the associate ratbeard there's a chalice in the treasure wrapped in sailcloth bring that or no no, no the associate is the rest of guns loot is yours. i guess mormo Go to the cave of yeah, the there plaza. he is. Madam Vadima waits within. She can teach you and send you to the crew looking for Gun's gold. Now, the She's only reason why... Expecting you. The only reason why I don't really particularly like Witch Doctors because of Mormo. But everything else is actually pretty good. And apparently we're really OP. We're also gonna grab this guy too, but let's talk to, to Vadima first. And powers will become available. I have been waiting for you. Your destiny so what is this called? And terrible. Bad company. You have much to learn. We must begin. You will find Captain Gunn's treasure, though it will not be what you expect. Seek Mormo, the witch doctor. The barkeep in the Kraken Skulls will send you to him. Before you go, apprenticeship must begin. There are ready for some training, are you? Well, thank you. The training menu shows the talents and powers Let's this train trainer that. offers. And even level five, we get this, um, which we already have. I wait. Oh, okay. Here it is. This is one that gives us health back. Um, what is it that? How do I get that? Is it from the pet? Okay, it's from our from our pet. There we go. But since we're here, let's go ahead and grab this guy too. Hola, tiny captain. I seek passage with you. This Carcarius, very powerful, but very noisy too. You will take him with you. I foresee great future. I am Carcarius, greatest shaman of the Grimtooth clan. You are small, tiny captain, but my powers will make you mighty in battle. So, and he's level what, five or six? Level well, five. We'll keep him as our little front guy. Campo, I like him. 
So let's go ahead and give him new talents. Um. Sure. We don't want him to die. And he actually comes with... Oh, what is this? Okay. No, that's actually pretty good. He seems pretty powerful for us. Um, actually, that's going to be where I'm going to end it for this episode. In the next episode, we'll talk to Skinny Pete and get Mormo and continue from there. So thanks for watching this one, and I'll catch you in the next one.